When our Holy Prophet وسلم, went to Taif and called the people there to guidance, they mistreated him and did not meet him kindly. They did not accept him. They sent the children to them and threw stones and rocks at him. The Prophet did not make a bad dua on them. He said they do not know to Allah He said these people do not know the thing, the goodness that we're trying to do so give them guidance is what the Prophet ﷺ prayed. The Prophet ﷺ went there for goodness to call them to the religion of Allah, to the to show the lot of grace of Allah to give them the greatest joy and felicity. They did not know its value and replied unkindly. This is the case all the time in the world. It continues to be so. Those who want to do good are answered with evil. And why is that? Because of ignorance. They tell them, we want to do good to you. They say, no, you mean harm for us. You want to do bad to us. Whereas they want to do goodness. That's what they're trying to do. It is hard to do good. Why is it hard? Because obstacles arise. Shaitan brings a thousand obstacles. It's easy to demolish but hard to build. So we need to know the value of these namas, these blessings. If we don't, just like the Prophet said, if they don't, just like the Prophet said, they don't know. Some later got their heads together and left in goodness and others went as bad ones. In the same way, today's people, their nafs is not accepting the goodness that is done to them. Shaitan is not accepting it. You are doing good to them, but they reply badly. Allah is always with the good ones. Therefore, don't, do not ever say, I'm going to do bad. Allah will give you the rewards of all the goodnesses that you do. People will not, but Allah will give you its rewards. Goodness is answered with goodness, and evil is certainly, it certainly brings evil. May Allah protect us, always make means for us to do good, to accept the good and be with the good ones, inshallah.